What's up guys, this is Gabe from s and Innovations and today I'm with LC Engineering and today we're working on a 2005 Toyota 2TR Tacoma pickup truck. This is LC Engineering's new supercharger kit. They've been working on this for quite a while. We've been assisting them with the injectors and the fuel injection management system. We use a Haltech computer system. We're here on the dyno, we're gonna make some passes. Uh, some interesting facts here is that the factory ECU and, uh, and system, the way that it works, is it works off of a mass airflow sensor. And with the Haltech system, uh, we use an internal MAP sensor that's inside the ECU. Now that internal MAP sensor is good for about 43 pounds of boost, so more than plenty for what we're doing today. We have a really good vacuum source, a really good manifold pressure source, and uh, we're good to go. We like to try to shoot around 200 horsepower, but the reality is, is when we try to shoot for numbers, sometimes we get in trouble, put too much time, you try to lean it out, and sometimes it could potentially damage something. What we're looking for is a nice, safe tune, and make sure everything's good, making power, but making a safe power so we have the reliability where we want. So that's what we're looking for today. not seeing any knock retard or the, the, the knock sensor is not going off or anything so I think so far so good oh uh, six and a half seven pounds horsepower number or our horsepower 192 learned a lot on the dyno um, we we're able to make an extra, just about almost 30 horsepower on the dyno by um, adjusting the ignition timing and, and getting air fuel ratio dialed in a little bit more. And we saw some good solid boost numbers, wasn't too bad. I like where we're at. Made good power for the boost that we're at. And um, at the end of it, we did some testing and tested some cam timing adjustments. Um, I have found in the past with a Toyota setup that if we extend the cam timing adjustments out just a little bit further than the RPMs we can pick up. And I threw some numbers in it, it was fairly aggressive. And then at the end, one of the last pulls we did is just zero all that out and see what happened. Our boost pressure went up, but our horsepower dropped significantly. So um, we, we learned a lot. We learned a lot about what this engine really wants and uh, the supercharger's running great. Um, and I think it's gonna be a really good platform. So I think it was good. <laughs> 